Okay, this is our reader's notebook um, for today. Um, actually, it's um, one of two reader's notebook for today. <laughs> so I'm gonna have you do page 93 and 98. So what um, for 93, I'm gonna read a story. Again, if you guys aren't watching the videos, there's really nothing you can do about these pages. Um, uh, it, it's one of those things that if we were in the classroom, I would have read the story and we still would have done this exercise. Um, but there's really no way for me to do this story that I can't just hand you the book. Um, and so I have to read it out loud to you guys and this is just the best way to do it. So um, sorry if you got to these and you were confused, but this is what this assignment is. So um, I'm gonna read the story and you're gonna fill and draw a picture and then you're gonna write the word of what the kindergartens, what the kindergartners felt during this time. Um, it's called Miss Bindergarten Celebrates the Last Day of Kindergarten. And so, you know, how do you guys feel about, think about your feelings of kindergarten being over? It could probably be a mixture of feelings. I know there's some excitement of, yay, I made it through my first real school year. Um, kind of sad because our situation is definitely different than what would have probably normally have been. I'm sad you're going to miss your friends because you're not always sure who's going to be in first grade next year. Excited that you get to go up a whole other grade level. So you can have a lot of different mixed emotions. But um, that's what you're going to be doing with page 93. And then page 98. Um, understanding characters. So the characters are the people in the story, right? So, um, Mrs. Bendergarten looks back into the empty classroom as she is leaving on the last day of school. So, this is what the character does. The character here is Mrs. Bendergarten. This is the physical thing, the action that she does. But then we have feelings. So, how does she feel? She feels sad. Does she feel happy? What does she feel when she looks back into an empty classroom? I know that I've been cleaning out my classroom and it's sad. It's empty. Um, it kind of feels lonely to not have all of your talking and noise and smiles in the room. Um, it definitely, the room feels a lot bigger than it did just because you guys aren't in there filling it up. So um, those are characters' feelings. So that is what you're going to do, and I am going to read the story. And I will do my best as the print is small, um, and hopefully you guys can see it. But Ms. Bindergarten celebrates the last day of kindergarten. <clears throat> it's the last day of kindergarten, and oh, 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 Adam brings carnations. Brenda has perfume. Christopher says it's for Mrs. B, a big goodbye balloon. Miss, Ms. Bindergarten celebrates the last day of kindergarten. Danny scrubs a table. Emily hands back rocks. Franny clears her bin and shouts, Oh no, three smelly socks. Ms. Bindergarten celebrates the last day of kindergarten. Gwen collects the building blocks. Henry packs them away. Ian hides beneath the desk. I really want to stay. Ms. Bindergarten celebrates the last day of kindergarten. Jessie shows off her bathing suit. Kiki says, many pinches. Lenny says, that's because you've grown a whole two inches. Maddie sets up a sprinkler. Noah collects the hose. Ophelia tries to take a drink and gets squirted in the nose.
Miss Bendergarten celebrates the last day of kindergarten. Patricia passes pizza. Gwinton says, cheese please. Raffi's pepperoni slices balance on his knees. Miss Bendergarten celebrates the last day of kindergarten. Sarah signs a memory book. Tommy prints good luck. Ursula tells about their trip to see a fire truck. Vicky hands out prizes. Wanda shouts, tremendous! Xavier gets a ribbon for perfect class attendance. Miss Bendergarten celebrates the last day of kindergarten. Yolanda yells, we love you. Zach gives a cheer. Goodbye, kindergarten, says Miss B. It's been a special year. Here's a little gift for you, a penny and a kiss. The penny for success to come, the kiss that you'll be missed. <clears throat> Miss Bendergarten says goodbye to kindergarten. And then let's look at this last picture. So with that, I just want you to think about what do you think the character feels? And then I want you to draw a picture here um, and talk about it. You know, you can write a word about it. And anyways, that is the assignment for a reader's notebook for today.